Companies nationwide are working to create more personal protective equipment for healthcare workers. Now, one local business is doing its part to get more face shields on the front lines. Brianna is back with this story. Brianna? Kate, the Charlestown Face Shield Project has only been up and running for about two weeks. And in that time, they've built a little over 6,700 face shields and they've donated them to hospitals here in Massachusetts, New Jersey, and New York. The shields are being produced at the Dark Monk Shop in Charlestown. They typically make performing arts equipment. Owner Chad Bennett says they've cleared out their 1,500 square foot space to set up a production line. And Bennett says he wanted to focus on shields because they provide a great physical barrier for those on the front lines fighting the virus. Plus, the shields are reusable and they can be sanitized with an already hospital approved method. Bennett says the stories he's heard from the frontline workers keep him and his team focused on making more shields. If I start to tell the stories, like almost any of them, I break down. Like I, I literally just start crying and, and, and I can't take it. So I can't even, I focus on finding 100 more sheets of polycarbonate or ordering rivets or getting food for the staff or something. And, and that's it. I, I, I can't, if I try to process the big stuff, I can't keep going. It's, it's too much. Well, their goal is to make and donate 20,000 shields, but they do need some help purchasing the materials. So far, they've raised $31,000 through a GoFundMe, but they'd like to hit 50,000. So if you would like to donate, we do have a link with all the information on our website, cbsboston.com. Chris, they've had people volunteer to drive to New York in one day to drop off these shields. I mean, Brianna, this is really awesome, and I love that it's happening right here in Charlestown.